I've his, uh, published two books on the history of the shipping industry in Atlantic Canada. One of them was Labor History. It was a history of uh, seafaring labor. That was the title of the book too, Seafaring Labor. History of sailors in the sailing ships of Atlantic Canada in the 19th century. The other book, it's called Maritime Capital, was the history of the rise and decline of the shipping industry in Atlantic Canada. I guess the main purpose of the books was to help us to understand why there was such a big shipping industry in Atlantic Canada in the 19th century. Uh, it was, Canada had the fourth largest merchant marine in the world in the 1870s and most of those ships were built and owned in the maritime provinces and Newfoundland. Um, so the big question was why did we have such a big shipping industry and then why did it decline? So that's what uh, particularly the second book, Maritime Capital, was all about.